where you bet. Cause I was just so sick of not having the right profile of snowboard on the mountain. If I wanted to rip pow, but I came out with the park board, I was super frustrated. If I wanted to hit jumps, but I was on the, the reverse camera, I was like, what am I gonna do? But now when I saw Nate on the side of the road, I was like, come on little buddy, come be my caddy. Like all my problems are fixed. Oh, this is nice corduroy. We're looking at 20, 30, 40. Like half cab front three, back three? Cab five? Rocker? No, dude. The mini? No! The split! No, nah, dude, just give me the camber! Alright, I'll see you at the next feature. Oh, they're sliding. Nice! Let's get the jib! Give me the rocker. What kind of butter should I do? The one that goes on toast! All right, we got powder, cornice, powerboard or custom. I'm thinking powerboard. Powerboard. Here we go. Woo! Hey, they just rolled out those greens for you. They're gonna pot real nice. <laughs> So obviously having a snowboard caddy and bringing out seven different snowboards, it's just not the right move. It's, it's so silly. However, I have here a snowboard that is every board in one, the game changer, the Proteus Evolve. So Proteus came up with this snowboard that can change shape. You heard that right. It can go from camber to reverse camber to flat to just a raised nose for powder. Whatever you want this board to be, you can make and I'll show you how. Okay, so right now this snowboard is camber. You can see it, it pops up. I can get my finger underneath it. This thing is ready to go. Camber means that it's a C, so it's gonna bite the snow. It's gonna be really poppy. But let's say I wanna do some butters. I want this thing to be, you know, rocker. I just reach in my pocket, pull out this fancy little tool. It has a rocker side, a camber side, and in the middle is this in insane adjustment system thingy. Pull this guy out, and then you can adjust the profile of your board. So if I want to go to rocker, I can take rocker and I face it outwards. I go like this, and I'm just gonna start cranking away. Now you can see like it's rocker now. The the contact point is now raised off the table, which is insane, and it works insane. Like I've rockered this thing out and gone buttering, and it absolutely rips the butters when you put it in rocker mode. But let's say I want to hit some rails. I want to be a little jibby, but I don't want. I still want to have some pop, some spring spring to me, and I, I want to go flat profile. You can do flat profile as well. Right here are three different lines. The furthest one out is for camber, the middle is for flat, and the far one is for rocker. So you just adjust this thing and there's this little red line that will move as you are adjusting so you know where you are with your profile. It is so easy to put the board in the profile that you want it to be in. And I don't know, like it's the most incredible snowboard that I've ridden that works that's weird and new and something so different. Like so many people are gonna hate on this thing because it's new and different, but it is wild. Now where I see the Proteus really dominating is for beginners. Someone that can start with the board, rocker for their first day on the mountain. And then as they're getting better at snowboarding, they can put it to flat profile, which I think is the great profile for intermediate snowboards, snowboarders. And then when you become a good rider and you're ready for that stiffer board, that harder pop, the better carve, you put this thing into camber mode. And once again, if you get a pow day out of nowhere and you're like, oh, I didn't bring a pow board, just raise the nose to rocker, keep the back either flat or camber, or you could rocker it out. And then you could just rip pow however you want to. It's insane. Almost as insane as Proteus gave us our own pro model version of the board. This thing is mean, green, and insane. It's got the Evolution logo under the Evolve. It looks incredible. I'm gonna probably pop up a photo right now so you can see it without the bindings on. The quality build of this board is legit as well. They're all handmade. They're not like mass produced. They're made with love and attention to detail. I was blown away on this board. I'm not gonna lie. I got on it. I was a little skeptical. It blew my mind. I had a blast. And once again, just being like, you know what? Let's do some butters, put it into rocker. Ah, let's make some turns, put it into camber. I wanna hit some rails, make it a flat board. That's insane. So this board is in the description. Check out Proteus. Thank you for sending me the board. This was a sponsored video, so um, just know that. But I'm stoked on the board. If you want a snowboard with an Evolution logo on it, you now have a chance to snag one. Yeah, Proteus, you guys made something pretty cool. So with that, Tim Okay, I'll subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching. Keep evolving. We'll see you tomorrow in another video. It's daily on this snowboard channel. And we do stuff like this daily. <laughs>